Welcome back everybody. In today's video we'll be taking a look at two frauditors getting arrested. It looks like one was for domestic assault and the other was for either interfering or obstruction. She was pretty crazy yelling at the top of her lungs like a crazy woman. Besides that we'll be taking a look at the same frauditor getting a ticket and losing his mind. So with that being said, enjoy the video. Excuse what me, is officer. Hey, talk to you. What is your RAS? May I have your reasonable articulable suspicion for arresting him? You all set? What did I do? He's under arrest. To make for what? Call. We've already told you domestic no, assault. No, you didn't. Domestic assault. I just assault? told you. Assault? Yes. Uh, on who? Next door. Who? Look up his mom. Look, look up. What is uh, domestic I, assault? I, I, yes, his mother. Okay. For what? How did he domestically assault her? He did. Probable cause. How? The victim's inherently reliable in state of Massachusetts, okay? How? Have okay. That's all you need to know. No, that's not true because she's lying. That's the thing. She's lying. So it seems like this frauditor assaulted his own mother, which is pretty despicable. Now, this woman that's recording could just record if she wants. I'm sure the cops have no issues with it, but she wants to interfere and put herself in the situation. In just a moment, she's going to learn that that was probably not the best idea. About him. Hey. She hey, lied. Hey, 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 he lied. Stop. Stop. I didn't do Stop. anything, Stop. and Stop. he Stop. didn't either. Stop. She's gonna, lying. You, right now, you're about Stop. borderline Just interfering. Just so you know, Stop. officers, she is lying. Okay. Okay. Interfering. There was no assault taking borderline place. Do you even know what assault means? What does assault mean? It's attacking someone. No, that's assault and battery. Yeah. So how did he assault her? He didn't threaten her. You don't have to touch somebody for assault. He have didn't nice threaten her. So, but stay assault is threatening, stay right? He done. did not threaten He's her. If here, anyone threatened, that you is her. Me. And so does he have bail? Now, why the hell is she asking the arresting officers if he has bail? That's something the jail would handle. He hasn't even been processed yet. How the hell are they supposed to know? I know what you did and your mom is lying. Lying. She is lying. She is lying to you officers. Lying. You, I am on. I am right here. Yes, I'm taking his body camera. I would like to get his property. May I have his property now? Please. Thank you. I would like his property. He wants to give me his body camera. You can give me that. You guys are, no, this is wrong. You're wrong. There was no assault. She is lying. No, you're not. She's lying. Yeah. He won't let, he's going to give it to me. Your mom lied and said you assaulted her. What? What? He's trying to tell me. What, babe? Can he please talk to me? Let him talk to me and he'll stop yelling. Really? Stop. I got it on camera. Yeah, that is illegal. Stop. Illegal stop. against stop. the law. Stop. Yeah, that's against the law, officer. Now, what exactly is against the law? Using a flashlight? Yeah, I don't think so. Nice try, lady. It looks like the psycho Karen probably watched one too many frauditor videos and now she thinks she knows the law. You know the it. The that is against the law. That is against job. the law. May I have this property that you just fucking probably broke? Yes. 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 Is it, if it's 40 bucks, yes, I can. Because your mom said you assaulted her. She said you assaulted her. What? Stop. Don't, just go, babe. Just go. And you better not be. You guys are doing this is illegal. You don't have body cams. I got you all on film. I want stop, officer stop, name stop, and badge stop, numbers. Stop, stop, what is your stop, name? Stop. May you have your name? Take a look. Name? Take I can't look. read. How's that? What if I can't read? What if I can't right read? What if I can't read? The way that her and her boyfriend are acting, I wouldn't be surprised if none of them can read. It seems like being illiterate is a requirement for being a frauditor. 
Three what is eight it? And right there. Three, three one, one eight, eight and yeah. what? Right there. Officer That's what Cunningham, you say to right the uh, to the yeah. To the three one eight. It's right there on my uniform. Yep. You say that okay. to the uh, judge, right? right, right three one right eight. Right May right I have your right name and badge right number, here. please? She's in here. May I have your name Sergeant and badge Tinas, number? Excuse me, you're interfering. Sergeant Tinas. May I have your name and badge number, please, sir? Thank. Yeah. Failure to identify. Okay. That's nice. May I please have your name and badge and number, sir? And I didn't back. do anything. Times. No, Stop. I didn't do anything. What Stop. the hell? Stop. I didn't do anything. I did nothing wrong. Nothing. I'm not interfering. I'm staying on private Detective property here resting you. Because I'm asking for your name and badge no. number. I said, get out of the way. And so I did. I'm on the lawn. You know what? You can explain the court. Give me my phone back. You can't have it in the cruiser. Yes, I can. No, you can't. What is going You're under arrest. That's what's right. I Grow up. Learn how, to be a, learn how to be an adult. But I didn't, oh! I didn't do anything. Okay. I am. Now that was hilarious. When the officer said, grow up, learn how to be an adult, I almost lost it. Unfortunately, frauditors will never be able to grow up because they act like entitled toddlers all the time. With that being said, let's move on to the next clip. It's the same clowns. They got a ticket at the park and they're losing their minds. You ready? How are you gonna just give me a warning and not nobody else that smokes around here? I'm not, no one's signing it. Yeah, time. like, how how are you gonna get, give me a warning yeah. when everybody else smokes it's around it's here? It's huh? it's no, 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 be quiet. Hold on, because Please. You are being why? Targeted. Why, Butler? Fine. Why? Can I give it? Why? This is a retaliatory because of what I do. Hold on, who said? Marissa, you've been verbally advised about no smoking as of today. Yeah, so why? Uh, dude, it doesn't matter, dude. Perfect. It don't matter. Because he verbally It, it doesn't just matter. Just it don't matter. Don't argue. You're targeting me, Butler. Don't talk to him. You're targeting me, Butler. Yeah, don't walk up there. Walk around this side. No trespassing. You see those signs up there? It says no trespassing. Oh, it, it's okay for you to trespass, but we can't. So for those who aren't familiar with this guy, he's called Cape Cod News Now Auditor Journalist or some dumb shit like that. And basically, he's just a degenerate. He goes around town screaming like a psycho, getting drunk, getting arrested. He has like four or five arrests on his channel. And, you know, he's been at it for about four years. He only has a thousand subs, which is pitiful when it comes to frauditors because it's so easy for them to get subs. And yeah, he's just sticking with it. He's determined to make it work, to be a real journalist. Why are you talking to me, Butler? Is it because I film you on the year oath that you don't uphold? We got E234, and we got this piece of douche right here that we already know who Butler is. Because he's in a m many videos, and guess what? I'll keep smoking down here. I want you to write me that ticket. Write me that $50 ticket, bro. Write it. So I can fight it in court and make it fucking easier to get those signs taken down. Come on, just like I'm in the process of getting those no trespassing signs down. Huh? You want to be a creep, Butler? You want to be a creep? Yeah, creep. So let's analyze what just happened over here. First of all, he's chasing a moving car, which is never a good idea. And second of all, as soon as the officer stops and opens his door, the frauditor just turns around and runs, which is hilarious. I thought you were being a tough guy. What changed? Now, let me play that back just for those who missed it. Huh? You want to be a creep, Butler? You want to be a creep? You're a f creep! You're targeting me, bro. And I'm out here also helping you out. But you want to target me? Hey. 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 
You'll be in a lawsuit, butler. Shh, you don't need to get arrested. Stop it. Go away. I have no issue with that one. I know. He's a creep. He's mad because I called him a creep. That's fine. Butler is nothing but a creep. So this is the lady that was arrested before. I figured this is probably what we were to expect, but it's good to see it. You know, when I look at this picture, there is only one word that comes to mind. Actually, two words. Investigative journalist. That's the first thing that comes to mind when I look at this First Amendment auditor. Go. I don't need you to arrest him. And he wants to. Butler wants to arrest you, so leave him alone. If you get arrested, I can't bail you out. Stop. Okay, car, car parts, you don't back down. Over and out. So he said Cape Cod Cop Watch doesn't back down. Unfortunately for you, buddy, that's exactly what you just did. You backed down. Your girl came to you and said, stop it. And you listened to her and you backed down. So what you just said makes absolutely no sense. Let's move on to the last clip. somebody up there Where is he? Look at that, they got cameras looking on at us, so we have cameras looking at them. There's somebody right inside the door here, it looks like. I can see behind the tent. Oh, he's coming out. Can I help you? Did I ask for your help? No. Okay. It's just wondering why you're filming our, our building. Okay. The federal government building. We don't usually allow any kind of photography or video cameras. Inside. Inside. Right. Yeah. Well, am I inside? No. I'm okay. Just wondering if there's anything I can help you out. Well, you could get me a cheeseburger. <laughs> no, I can't do that. Well, sure you could. Yeah, see if you could help me. But if you need anything, though, uh, <clears throat> yeah, we're inside. Okay. So as you can see, this unemployed loser has nothing better to do than go harass the soldiers at the Army Recruitment Center. I mean, what the hell is wrong with you? Here's a perfect opportunity to join and do something positive for our country, but instead you want to harass the people there. Absolutely disgusting, man. These guys have no shame whatsoever. Let's see if I can see how well I can see him. No, it's hard to see. Well, it looks like they created privacy already. Because they wanted privacy, they put the uh, shades down. So, <laughs> I guess that's it. <laughs> they created privacy in a hurry. So, oh, there's a spot we can see in there, right there. You know what they say, right? You want privacy? Create privacy. And even if you do, the dumb frauditor will stick his cell phone into the glass to try to creep on you anyways. Get my camera to focus there. Oh, 
Well, they pulled them on, looks like. I guess that's one way they can create privacy by lowering the shades like that. Huh. Oh, okay. Well, I guess that was pretty quick because they were pretty good. They just kind uh, of. Goodness, what a glorious day. Yep. That's a nice little kickstand you got there. Well, it's more than a kickstand. It's works very well. Yes, it's carbon fiber actually. Yeah. Really light. Nice lightweight. Yeah. It actually came as a part of a tripod. So what are you doing? You shooting a documentary? I'm making a video uh, for a uh, distribution, maybe. Washington is a single party consent state for recording. That's not true. It is. No, it's not. Well, single party, yes. One. No, no, no. I... Two party consent state, I'm sorry. Nope. You're wrong. Actually, the frauditor is wrong, unsurprisingly. Washington is a two-party consent state, meaning you need the speaker's permission to record a private conversation. The applicable statute, RCW 9.73.030, makes most type of audio recordings illegal. Just so you know, frauditor, maybe next time it would be better to do your research. Are you standing in public? Yes. Okay. You have no right to privacy in public. Sim Simple as that. You have no right to privacy in public. Yeah, but this is our space. We rent this property out, and you know your presence here is distracting from our. You know, I'm not stopping you from doing anything. Is there a reason why you're here? I already told him what I'm doing. Are we asking politely to leave, sir? No, this is public property. You guys aren't aware of federal laws then? We're aware of the laws. Oh. What's the law say then? What law am I talking about? Like I said, it's, you know, what law am I talking about? Kind of distracting and, and what law? What normal that you're sitting here filming our building, you know, so we would just politely ask you to leave. Okay. What law am I breaking? Huh? What law am I breaking? I can't think of any specific law you're breaking. Like I said, I was just yeah, politely asking you if you could from in front of our store. Okay, you can ask. All right, sir, if you're not gonna be able to uh, allow us to have our space, we're gonna leave you alone at this time, but... Um, it's up to you, I'm just standing here. We, we understand that you're just standing here and that you're well within your rights to stand where you're standing. Right. I'm gonna let you be at this time. Well, you're the one yeah. coming out here and bothering me, so go about your day. We, we would ask that you don't uh, film the you can ask, but you can't trespass my eyes. This clown with the you can't trespass my eyes. Oh my god, that is such a tired line. Even the major frauditors don't use that anymore. Like, it doesn't mean anything. It's so stupid. This guy needs to come up with some more original material. Alright, well, thank you, sir. You have a good day. Well, just when I thought they were going to be pretty good about it and just shut the drapes, they come out and tried to hassle me a little bit. Not too much, but some. But 
I guess they got the memo from the one up north that they can't do that. So that's pretty much it for this loser. Once again, we have a moron that has nothing better to do than to harass people that actually serve their country. Anyways, I'm done with this guy. Thanks for watching, everybody. Please like and subscribe. I hope you enjoy the video, and I'll see you guys on the next one. I live here!